Hello, my name is Dr. Vlad Krotov, and in the next five minutes I will explain to you what Computer Information Systems, or CIS, is as a field, as a major of study, and a profession. In my opinion, Computer Information Systems, or CIS, is a field that stands on the following three main knowledge areas, technology, business, and data. When it comes to the technology pillar, uh, computer information systems programs, they tend to equip students with uh, advanced knowledge of some of the most popular programming languages, such as Python, Java, C Sharp, and C++. Uh, oftentimes, uh, web programming languages and technologies are especially popular in computer information systems and management information systems programs. This is done to enable computer information systems professionals upon graduation to develop software solutions for individuals and organizations. Quite often, computer information systems programs also include coursework related to networking and security, but usually this is not the primary emphasis of CIS programs. Also, most, if not all, computer information systems programs require coursework related to business or management. CIS student, students typically take courses related to marketing, management, uh, project management, accounting, economics, finance, and so forth. This is done to equip CIS students with the understanding of the general context within which various information and communication technologies are implemented. Also, since the very inception of the field and uh, the major uh, CIS programs emphasized coursework and all areas related to data and databases. In recent times, uh, this has been expanded to include courses in relation to data science or business analytics. So nowadays, it's quite common for computer information systems majors to take courses related not only to databases and basic descriptive and inferential statistics. This is something that many business majors uh, take. Uh, but also courses related to data visualization, advanced data analysis, machine learning, and as a part of that advanced uh, business analytics or, or data analysis coursework, CIS students typically learn such data analysis tools as uh, SQL language, SAS, Hadoop, Spark, R. Python is also used as a data science platform, as a data science tool quite a bit in computer information systems programs. So these are the three main pillars of knowledge for CIS majors and CIS professionals, technology, business, and data. These three pillars of knowledge, technology, business, and data, stand on the so-called foundation comprised of soft skills. These soft skills include such skills and capabilities as leadership, teamwork, communication, and personal integrity. Now, the reason I'm saying it's the foundation of the CIS knowledge areas is that if this foundation is missing, then those three pillars may fall. Those three pillars are no longer relevant. For example, as an IT professional, you may have access to sensitive data. If you are doing something unethical with this data, then you will get in trouble no matter how knowledgeable you are in relation to technology, business, or data. So that's why one needs to have personal integrity, which is comprised of the general awareness of the legal framework surrounding the field of information systems, as well as the most fundamental theories and principles of ethics for resolving various uh, ethical dilemma at the individual and organizational levels. Also nowadays, uh, various IT or ICT projects are delivered uh, while working in, in groups or teams of people. So if you cannot be uh, a valuable team member, then again, those three pillars, they are of little use. And also, at some point, you may not only work as a part of a team, but you will also be in charge of leading the team towards a particular goal. And that's why uh, leadership is, is another important quality that any CS graduate or CS professional should have. So all in all, I would say that a computer information systems graduate or professional is a business technology professional who draws from a variety of knowledge areas, specifically from the areas of technology, business, data, and also somebody who has, has a high level of personal integrity, somebody who has great communication skills, he or she can talk to various stakeholders comprising a particular IT project, and also the ability to lead others towards, towards attainment of a particular goal.